hell are you still doing here? Didn't Rex throw you out already? Throw out the mother of his child? I don't think so. Unbelievable. So you couldn't hold on to Rex any other way, and so you decided to make up a phony pregnancy. Great! It's not phony. I'm pregnant with Rex's child. Right, yeah, just like you were the stem cell donor to his real child. Read it and weep. You were sleeping when I came in. I didn't want to wake you. I wasn't really asleep. I just wasn't ready to see you. So, when are we going to talk about it? About the fact that you slept with my sister, probably knocked her up, and lied to me about it. How about now? Because I'm worried about it, too. Okay, so what lab tech did you blackmail this time? Nobody. A real doctor at the ER examined me and told me I was pregnant. You want me to pee on a stick for you or something? Ew, I'll pass. How did you find out about this news so fast anyway? Because I thought the only people who knew were my doctor and Rex and... Oh. Okay, so that's where my sister ran off to last night. Straight to her pal, Skylar. Stacy, we ran into each other and she was upset. Mm, yeah, and your strong, manly shoulders were just the place to cry. Cut it out. Okay, listen. Get your head out of the sand or wherever it is, because this pregnancy, it's just as good for you as it is for me. It'll tear Rex and Gigi apart, and then Gigi will be free to be with you. So why'd you lie to me? Do you think I wasn't going to find out? Stacy was prancing all over town, crowing about the fact she had slept with you. I asked you point blank, and you denied it. I, I, I didn't want to hurt you. you. didn't want... At least then, I was prepared. I was ready to hear it. Do you know how much worse it was hearing the truth the way I did, being humiliated by Stacy? I, I was going to... You should have just told me when I asked you, Rex. Even Skylar told you to tell me the truth. Skylar? You already talked to him about this? This isn't about Skylar. It's about us. Yeah, you're right. It's about us. Y yeah, I made the choice to lie to you. I, 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 I didn't want to tell you, Gigi. I didn't want to say it out loud because what I did... Sleeping with Stacy, it makes me so damn mad. And the person I'm mad at is not just your sister. It's you too. You're mad at me. I was shoveled a load of bull for months by the woman who said that she loved me. I was freaking out! Do you know what? that I was? I've never had a family, Gigi. Not a real one, and that's what we were. And you blew us apart. Stacy was blackmailing me. Yeah, I, I, I get it. But you should have come to me. You should have trusted me. We could have gotten through this together. But instead, you, you, you were breaking my heart day after day. You had me thinking that Stacy was this saint who was saving Shane's life. What the hell was I supposed to do? You, you, you practically pushed me into bed with her. I thought you understood that I did what I did for Shane. Yeah, I get that. But after Stacy gave you her ultimatum, why don't you talk to a shrink or a, a priest or something? Instead, you had me go on thinking the worst, breaking my heart over and over again. And when I confronted Stacy about what she did, you know what she said? She said that we must have not been all that solid if we broke up as easily as we did. Is that what you believe? All I can tell you is that I... Do you believe what Stacy said? That there wasn't enough between us to hold us together? I don't want to. 
But every time I think about how far you went to push me away and keep me away, it's like a knife in my heart. And I don't know where to put all that. You know, I am honestly worried about you, Stacy. I mean, I thought once Rex knew the truth, once he turned his back on you, that you would at least give up this little obsession of yours. It's not an obsession. Well, what would you call threatening to let his son die if you can't have him? What Rex and I had was real. It meant something. Not just to me, but to him, too. Okay, you're deluding yourself. So if making love to me didn't count, then why did he have to lie to Gigi about it? I love you with all my heart and soul. I've made such a mess of things. I don't blame you for sleeping with Stacy. I hate it. And I just hope that I haven't lost you because of it. I'm here now. Yeah. Physically. But if you can't forgive me, then we're just going through the motions. Damn it. Marasco. Damn it what? I love you. I want all this bad stuff to go away. So do I. We can do it, Balsam. We can forgive each other and start over. I want that. I want that more than anything. Who knows why Rex is pulling the crap that he does? He's not the first guy who's ever cheated and lied about it, but at least his lie is nothing compared to yours. And the truth came out. Yeah, with a little help from you. Stacy, you would have gotten caught anyway. And you're going to be caught again. I told you this is real. If, okay. If I weren't pregnant, why would I be looking at this? Hmm? All you need to know when you're having a baby. I want to know what to expect. Yeah, or, or fake it believably. Oh, my God, I told you. I will take up another pregnancy test that will get you off my back. Just when you find out I'm telling the truth, you need to step up and do the same. Do the same? Tell the truth about what? Your feelings for Gigi. We cannot let anything come between us again. Even this baby you're having with Stacy. We don't even know that there is a baby, and if there is, we don't know that it's mine. Rex, you saw that paper from the hospital. Oh, you're going there again. Stacy has all the power, and there's nothing we can do to fight her. Okay, okay. Seriously, we... Had sex... One time, what are the odds that she got pregnant? About the same as when I got pregnant after my first time with you. Look, if Stacy is pregnant, then she's never going to be out of our lives. Well, I'm sure as hell not going to take it on her say so. I'm going to find out the truth for myself. How? Well, I'm a PI, remember? Uh, yeah, I'm going to come with you. I meant what I said. We cannot let anything come between us. Whatever we find, whatever comes of this, we're solid. Solid. Yeah. Oh, I knew you couldn't resist getting in my face.